From the classroom to the newsroom, in the street and the field, this is the CUNY Graduate School of Journalism, and these are some of our success stories. I'm associate producer with the uh, Brian Ross unit at ABC News. I'm a staff writer for MainStreet.com. I'm a reporter here at Bloomberg News. The J School absolutely prepared me for the change in technology. The value of what you get, you can't get that anywhere else. Hello, I'm Roz Abrams. It was just three years ago that the CUNY J School opened its doors with a mandate from Chancellor Matthew Goldstein. Build one of the best graduate programs in the country and help increase diversity in the journalism profession. We are proud of how far we have come in such a short time. I can honestly say I don't think I would be in the Brian Ross unit if it wasn't for, um, you know, going to CUNY J School and having the opportunity to be a Carnegie Fellow and, and being here. In fact, what we have been taught is that the future is now and that the world of journalism is in our hands. Rules are being rewritten and we are the ones to write them. And the question is not if we are ready for the world, but rather if the world is ready for us. Starting life during a critical transition in our profession toward digital technology, we are producing some of the finest multimedia storytellers. Because we're so new, we've had a wonderful opportunity to reimagine journalism and journalism education. Sure, we teach all the eternal verities, the reporting, the writing, the critical thinking, the ethical values of traditional journalism. But we're also preparing our students, all of them, for this new world. In a building that once housed the award-winning New York Herald Tribune, we've built a state-of-the-art facility rivaled by none. We have a huge newsroom that was designed to be the heart of the school. We have a, a fully wireless uh, facility we have TV and radio studios and control rooms, broadcast editing suites, broadcast editing classrooms. Located in the heart of Times Square, we are right next door to the New York Times and an easy walk to a dozen other major media companies. Our three semester master's program offers a converged curriculum that allows all students to learn how to tell stories using print, broadcast, and interactive media formats. While some may say that the internet is hurting journalism, I think the opposite. The internet is bringing us tremendous new opportunities to do journalism in many ways. So it's vital that every student today leaves this school able to do journalism in all media. Technology and being on the cutting edge of technology is very important and this school provides that. You need to be original and you need to come up with your own stories because the demand for that is so great right now. And that's definitely something that I use every day, and I try to pitch my editors at least once a week, and that's all from the J School. Classes are taught by caring, experienced faculty who are working journalists with ties across the media community. Everyone is so unbelievably helpful and so available and so talented. It's only at the Kenyon Graduate School of Journalism where these people became more than mentors, more than instructors, but friends, lifelong friends. The average faculty member here has at least 20 years in the business, and that's true actually of the administration as well. Members of the faculty have won or shared six Pulitzer Prizes, uh, a couple of Emmy Awards, um, National Magazine Awards. Subject concentration was business. International uh, reporting concentration. Business and economy. Urban studies. International reporting. Business student. Urban reporting. Students choose one of five subject concentrations, arts and culture, business and economics, health and medicine, international or urban reporting. And by picking one, they develop an expertise in that particular subject. They develop sources, they gain confidence, and this allows them to do a more sophisticated form of journalism. Whatever beat they're gonna cover, whatever specialty, these skills will last them a lifetime. Outside the newsroom, students are able to practice their craft in the real world through the J School Summer Internship Program, the only one of its kind in the country to pay students a stipend. So everything that I learned in, in the classroom and, and the day book assignments and in lectures was reinforced you know, every day when I went to my internship. I also really like the fact that the internship is uh, subsidized. You get $3,000 for that. Luckily, I was actually offered a job here after the internship. Our New York City News Service syndicates students' work to local newspapers and major media outlets, such as the New York Daily News and the Huffington Post. On top of that, you cannot beat the price of what we have to offer. As the only public graduate school of journalism in the entire Northeast, 
we offer the best value in the country. I have learned so much since I've been here, and I know that once December comes, I'll be prepared to go into the job market. And I came today because I want you to know on this very important day in your lives that some of us from the past think you are very brave for still believing journalism is a calling worthy of your utmost. That while the technology changes, keeping watch on those in power is the indispensable function of a free press. We have come so far in a remarkably short period of time, and that's just the beginning of the CUNY Journalism School story. I'm Roz Abrams. Thanks for joining us, and stay tuned.